Well, hello. Um, it's been quite a while since I've uploaded a video. A couple years, actually. I believe the last video that I actually recorded and uploaded was an update about getting into my PhD program. This was in the thick of the 2020 pandemic lockdown. So um, a lot has happened since then. I've relocated for my PhD and I am now in my fourth year, which flew by. Um, I am in my fourth year. I am preparing to sit for my comprehensive exams in literally less than two weeks. Um, wow. Um, I don't know how I feel about it. Um, I'm just kind of ready to get it over and done with. Um, but I think I am going to attempt to chronicle um, my experience um, in this process, um, my PhD process. So unfortunately you guys missed the um, coursework season of PhD life for me. Um, but, um, and you really missed the comprehensive exam preparation part uh, because I am literally like at the point now where I'm supposed to stop reading after this week so I could just write and think and pull it all together in my mind. Um, but I um, will make an effort to share um, the final um, stages of my process, including um, actually sitting for comprehensive exams. I don't know that I will record while I am preparing for that or while I'm actually actively going through that, but I will try to get some in between um, and some after footage so that um, I can reflect and then we'll share how my experience was. Um, and then of course my proposal and my actual dissertation. So yeah, welcome back to my channel. I am Janice Renee um, and I've done a lot of different things on this channel. So right now we are working on our PhD, so that's what we will share. <laughs> um, and so, yeah, I'm excited to take you on that. So right now I am preparing to work on my syllabi uh, for my pedagogy exam. Um, I have to develop two syllabi and write a critical analysis for it based off of the reading list for that exam that I had to uh, prepare for. So I'm just going to work on um, my elective course. My introduction course is already done, so now I have to do an elective course. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this in the first video, but I am um, getting my PhD in homiletics and liturgics, uh, which is fancy language for preaching and worship. It's way more um, <laughs> technical than the way I just described it, but basically preaching and worship. Um, and so I am working on elective course. I'm not going to share too much about what that course is about because it is um, very specific to my dissertation um, and we'll share more about that on the other side of it. So let's get to work. You know just what you do, you do to me Play my emotions 
emotions like a pair of puppet strings. Did it ever occur to you, my heart's more than a toy? Please go easy on me, babe. Send message after message, forward my call. Next day you hear me back. So good morning. Um, yesterday kind of went by like a blur. But it's a brand new day and um, I am a morning person so it's not early for me but it's um, a little bit before 8 a.m. Um, I am a morning person so I really do prefer to get up around um, maybe 6 o'clock and get to work um, early while it's still dark outside but here we are. Um, I plan to read all day. I do have an appointment in the afternoon, so I'm going to spend, um, the first part of my day, uh, reading, and then, um, I am going to, um, probably relocate to a coffee shop, which is what I did yesterday. Um, I'm probably going to relocate to a coffee shop. There's tons of work to do today. Got a few more, very, very few more books, um, about two more books I want to read um, in preparation for comprehensive exams. So um, chipping that list down from 187 to two. Um, let's go. Um, so yeah, let's, uh, let's get to work. Good morning, um, and I hope um, you all are having a wonderful day. Um, still getting used to the vlogging thing, so it's, to be honest, it's actually been a couple days since um, the last um, time I uh, spoke, but um, we are here, and I am grateful um, for the push from my sister to just go ahead and just do it, to keep doing it and to not stop. Um, and so here I am. Um, I am wrapping up one of my exams. Um, been working on it for the last couple of days, trying to get it solidified. This one has to be submitted. Um, so um, I definitely can feel the pressure <laughs> of comprehensive exams in writing this particular essay. But also, I definitely feel a little affirmed because I'm in reading back to myself what I wrote. I feel like I could tell that I've read a lot. I could tell that I've um, gained a whole lot more knowledge and that my writing has gotten better um, even in the last year. So. While comprehensive exams is hard, um, it is definitely the hardest thing I've ever done academically. Um, matter of fact, the entire um, experience of a PhD is the hardest thing I've ever actually done academically. I am grateful because um, I definitely at this stage can see how much I've grown um, even since starting the program. So um, there's a lot to be grateful for. God is good <laughs> and I am just really, really grateful for how much I've grown over this last year. So even though it's hard, um, I have discovered that I can do hard things. Um, and so I hope that encourages somebody who's watching because woo, this thing is hard, but you can do hard things. Um, so yeah, today I am finishing up this particular exam. 
um, so I could send it off to a friend of mine so she can look at it. Uh, to actually, I'm sending it to two friends. They can look at it, give me some feedback so I can edit it before I have to submit it next week. Um, and then exactly one week from today, I will actually be sitting, officially sitting, um, um, for the first time. And what that means is, for those of you who don't know, uh, what that means is I will be given a, I think it is a six hour window, um, and I will, within that six hour window, I will go to my campus and within that six hour window, um, I will receive my questions for the exams and then I will write the answers um, unassisted. Um, so it'll just be off the top of the dome. And um, that will happen for the first time next Wednesday, well, exactly one week from today. So um, that exam I'm actually pretty excited about because it's theories and methods and um, in my field and um, that's my bag. <laughs> like that's my theories and methods exam and my history exam. Those are where I feel the most confidence uh, because they're very particular to my interests. Um, and they were actually really, really fun to kind of to kind of read through. Uh, not easy, um, but fun. You know, once I got through um, the tough stuff. So yeah, I'm excited about that. And um, yeah, so today that's what I'm gonna do. As of right now, I plan to stay home for that. Um, yeah, because it's like two degrees outside, so I'll probably stay home for that. Um, and then I have a study group tonight. I have a study group with some fellow um, homileticians in training. Um, they're at a different institution than I am, but um, we study together at least three times a week. Um, so I have that tonight. Um, in between, my plan is to finish this this morning by noon um, so I could take a little bit of a break um, in the afternoon. And then um, tonight I plan to work out some test responses to um, some questions um, for my oral exam. Um, and yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Um, and let's go ahead and get started.